Hey guys, how you doing? This is your boy Rich. We're 22 days, 9 hours, 9 minutes, and 25 seconds away from history. And we have some breaking news, which you can find all on www.richtvlive.com. Absolutely free. It's true. All the news is right there. Absolutely free. And you can follow us on YouTube. Just subscribe. The greatest streaming platform alive. And you can contact us on all social media platforms. Follow us everywhere. Discord, our podcast, Instagram, YouTube, and our group chat, our secret chat, 24-7 stock advice, tips, absolutely free. It's true. What's the big news, you ask? And the markets were green again. Uh, it's true. Look at all the winners. And your boy Rich has been predicting winner after winner after winner. Absolutely free. And we got some more breaking news from my favorite, my one and only Aurora Cannabis. It's true. Aurora Cannabis Inc. announces results for the fourth quarter and 2018 fiscal year. Woo! Let me dig in. 223% top line annual revenue growth. I say pardon? 223% revenue growth? Well positioned for Canadian adult consumer use market. Process commenced to list securities on senior exchange. I love it. Let's go. Aurora Cannabis Inc. on the TSX, ACB, on the OTCQB, ACBFF, and in Frankfurt, 21P, WKN, A1C4, WM, announced today its fiscal and operational results for the fourth quarter and fiscal year ended June 30th, 2018. Right after the market closed, it announced that they made $19 million in Q4 after generating $16 million in Q3. I love it. What do you think about this? If you like it, smash the like button. Comment down below. What do you think about this revenue growth? Do you think this is good? This is. Do you think this was as expected? Do you think this is less than what you expected? Is this more than what you expected? I want to know what you think. I love me some Aurora. I own Aurora. I've owned Aurora since it was at $1.50. And I own this bad boy. And I think it could go higher. And I predicted it would go up 100%. It's going to a senior exchange. It's already announced that. And its revenue is growing. Let's look at the Q4 2018 highlights. Revenue of 19 million up 223% compared to the same period of 2017. Pro forma Q4 2018 revenue of 33 million, including med relief. Wow. So when you add med relief in there, they're at 33 million, which makes them officially. It's true. It makes them officially bigger than everyone in the industry. They are now numero uno. It's true. Congratulations to anybody that holds Aurora Cannabis. They are now officially number one in revenue in the industry. Wow. Gross margin on medical cannabis of 74%, huge. Up 28% compared to the fourth quarter <laughs> of 2017. This increase was primarily due to a higher average selling price per gram of dry cannabis, coupled with a <laughs> coupled with a higher proportion of cannabis oil sales in the company's sales ratio. Let's go! Cash cost of sales and cash cost to produce per gram of dried cannabis sold both decreased 11% compared to the same period in 2017. This decrease was this decrease was primarily primarily due to efficiencies from automation and yield expertise. Active registered patients of 43,000. Wow. 43,308 active patients up 164%. Wow. Unbelievable compared to the fourth quarter of 2017. I'm loving this, guys. Q4 
kilograms produced and kilograms sold of 2,212 and 1,617 up 90% and 114% respectively compared to the same period in 2017. Seven facilities with production licenses. I say pardon? Five facilities with sales licenses. Wow. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. 2018 fiscal highlights. Revenue of 55 million up 206 percent compared to the prior year. So their revenue is up to 55 million compared to 17 million of last year. Up 206 percent. Gross margin on medical cannabis of 65 percent up 16 percent compared to F fiscal year of 2017. This increase was primarily due to a higher average selling price program of dry cannabis coupled with a higher proportion of cannabis oil sales in the company sales ratio. Kilograms produced and kilograms sold of 5,632 and 5,022 up 85% and 111% respectively compared to fiscal year of 2017. 11 strategic acquisitions compared, completed and one in progress. Wow. Total headcount grew to 1,400 from approximately 300 at the end of 2017. Pro forma cannabis inventory and biological assets, including med relief, of 88.8 .8 million. This is just a behemoth. A comprehensive discussion of Aurora's financials and operations are provided in the company's management discussion and analysis, MDNA, and financial statements, which will be filed on CDAR at www.cedar.com and on the Aurora website. This is unbelievable. What does management have to say about this huge news, this huge spike in revenue, growth, acquisitions, licenses, partnerships? This is unbelievable. And this is why I love me Aurora Cannabis. This is why they've always been my number one. I'm not going to lie to you. I've always said that. <laughs> I've always said that. Canopy Growth was number one because they're just higher, but I love me Aurora Cannabis. I don't own Canopy Growth right now, but I own Aurora Cannabis. It's true. What does management have to say? Aurora made substantial progress towards our st strategic, strategic goal of becoming the global scale and margin leader in the cannabis industry. Establishing a vertically integrated company with a broadly diversified product offering with a large global footprint. Global. That's the whole world, people. Said Terry Booth, CEO of Aurora. Our high pace, consistent execution has enabled us to complete a number of transformative acquisitions, bringing together industry leading companies in terms of scale, quality, efficiencies, plant and medical science product development and innovation, brands and international distribution, Canamed, Med Relief, just to name a few. Mr. Booth added, with coast-to-coast with -coast supply agreements and our strategic investment in Alcana, we are very well positioned to capitalize on the significant adult consumer use opportunity in Canada. With reported Q4 revenues of 19.1 million, Pro forma Q4 revenues of over 33.1 million. Wow. Numero uno, they are now number one. It's true. They are number one. And production capacity is scaling up rapidly. We anticipate acceleration revenue growth during fiscal 2019. We have invested heavily in our organizational capabilities, including sales, marketing, and corporate talent and capacity to ensure we will continue to drive strong and sustainable long-term growth. Love it, Mr. Booth. Mr. Booth concluded, today Aurora ticks all the boxes for sustainable success and leadership in the cannabis industry. Aurora is capitalizing on a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. 
He sounds like your boy Rich. And establishing new industry standards in terms of execution, science, cultivation, international expansion, and product development that position us exceptionally well to do so. We are very proud of our achievements over the past year, and we look forward to fiscal 2019 as we continue to execute. Huge news. Uplisting. Aurora intends to list its securities on a senior stock exchange. In advance of a listing on a senior U.S. exchange, Aurora will file a Form 40F registration statement with the securities. Wow, I love this. United States Securities and Exchange Commission. The listing of the company's securities remains subject to exchange approval and the satisfaction of all applicable listing and regulatory requirements. A trading date will be made public once all regulatory formalities are satisfied. Terry Booth, Aurora CEO, added, listing our shares on a senior U.S. exchange reflects the level of corporate and business maturity and our high-paced execution. This listing provides access to a broader investor audience who gain the opportunity to participate in our continued success. Wow. 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 The news keeps coming. Look at this press release. Look at all their partnerships. I'd have to read this all day. I'm going to let you guys read the rest of the news. Let's just say that Aurora has just broken the news that we were waiting for. It's huge. What do you think about it? Risk TV Live is strictly for education entertainment purposes. Do your due diligence. Do your research before you invest in anything that we talk about here on Rich TV Live. This press release has got highlight after highlight after highlight. Literally a global company that is about to go onto a senior exchange. Look at this financing from the BMO, the Bank of Montreal. Oh yeah, just, you know, only $150 million. Oh, sorry, $200 million. I'm just saying. I mean, that ain't some chump change. And look at all the strategic investments. Strategic investments in Hempco. Strategic investments into Chum. Strategic investments into Tigod. The highlights keep coming. This is a company that's strategically positioned to explode. International developments in Italy, Germany, Malta. I mean, this is just crazy. I could just be reading this news for the next hour. That's how big it is. That's how huge this press release is. I anticipate Aurora Cannabis will explode tomorrow based on this news. Now, these are forward-looking statements. This is just my prediction. I'm not a licensed advisor. Do your due diligence. Do your research. I own Aurora. I fully intended to go up tomorrow, okay? I will keep you updated on the news as it breaks, as it happens, but this is huge news. And Aurora had a big day today. They are already up. 3% and they are an 88% buy on bar chart. Aurora has been the biggest winner for your boy, Rich. I have done very well on Aurora. They are up 363% in the last year alone, 131% in the last three months and 60% in the last month. And you can see the news is starting to trend everywhere. It is everywhere. You can find all the information you need at www.richtvlive.com. Just hover over stocks. Follow us and contact us under the contact section. Everywhere, the big news, markets are green, and Aurora Cannabis just dropped the bomb. Aurora Cannabis Inc. announces results for their fourth quarter and 2018 fiscal year. Another successful year for Aurora Cannabis. Congratulations to everybody that's involved. If you're not winning, you're not watching. This is your boy Rich, and I'm out. Peace. Oh yeah. 22 days, 8 hours, 55 minutes, and 9 seconds away from history. It's true. I'm up. The news is everywhere. It's true.